Now to that Florida teenager who's charged with impersonating a doctor's assistant and actually treating patients. His trial is now underway and in opening statements, his lawyer said the hospital is to blame. And ABC's John Schriffen has that story. Matt, why did you do this? Depending on who jurors believe, Matthew Scheidt was either a 17-year-old overeager teen interested in medicine. Other individuals did not believe he was a PA. Or he was a skilled con man playing doctor dressed in his scrubs, the stethoscope around the neck, even had the terminology. Come fly with me. Like a scene from the movie, Catch Me If You Can. I'm a doctor. The now 18-year-old Florida man is on trial this morning, accused of masquerading as a physician assistant in this Osceola, Florida hospital. He faces 25 years in jail for impersonating a PA and practicing medicine without a license, even performing CPR on a patient who was overdosing. When he was arrested last September, he talked openly to police about what happened. That's when he said, can you take over CPR? I started doing CPR on her for like a minute, two minutes, while he just went out there and got the medication. But in court Tuesday, Scheidt's attorney blamed hospital administrators who gave Scheidt a badge meant for a physician assistant without checking his credentials, a fact prosecutors were forced to concede. Did you verify what Mr. Scheidt had told you? No, I didn't. And why did you not verify? Uh, the office was very busy. Scheidt's lawyer says he never lied and never intended to deceive anyone, and that he told those who asked that he was a student. But prosecutors lined up a series of witnesses who said the teen intentionally played the part of a professional. But you specifically <coughs> saw Ms. Mr. Scheidt, Matthew Scheidt, performing chest compressions. Yes. I had walked into the room and observed him with the stethoscope to, the patient's, to a patient's chest, uh, listening to breath sounds and uh, he had an IV catheter in his hand. And the prosecution will pick up with their long list of witnesses again today. Interestingly, once this trial wraps up, Scheidt faces other charges for impersonating a police officer, even allegedly pulling over a car. Now, for that offense, Josh, he could face up to an additional 22 years in prison. The levels of life-imitating art here uh, No, no bounds. John Triffin, thank you for that. <laughs>